Pressure Slicer Update 2.9.1 in 60 seconds. Let's do it. First feature, use beam interlocking, allows you to print multiple parts and have an actual mechanical connection between the two parts, increasing the ratio between volume and surface. Now you can print two materials that should not work with each other and should stick together. Feature number two, sequential printing. So now you can actually print part one by one and while auto aligning everything, you'll be able to go back in time in the slicer and actually get a representation of the tool head. And now you can actually make sure that the tool head is not crashing into the other part, allowing you to print multiple parts sequentially, one by one, something that before the slicer would not allow you to do without modifications. So that's pretty cool. Pressure slicer 2.9.1, pretty great features.